made flesh. That day drew a broken tower out of the tarot pack, a plume of flame, and over the wreck a vast flower with ragged petals of soft white ash that was once flesh and useless paper blooming over the postcard perfect blue. Of all the tiny figures falling end over end, there were two who had stepped up holding hands to give themselves together to the air. A love that, sudden and certainly, I knew I didn't share and didn't want to share with anyone but you. Your sunlit demons, your cigarettes and fire escapes, your petals and grenades, your laugh like the chime of wind and icicles, the chuckle of fire and ecstasy of its own burning. And at my fingertips were 10 digits you had asked me never to dial again. And then it seemed my whole head, the dot on this little eye, would blow like the top off a dandelion. And then the seed pods of my eyes split into tears and I felt the swift clutch at my throat that was the root of cruelty and tenderness worming its way in. You are the hummingbird that comes, a pure vibration, wings a blur, propeller burring a million beats to keep still, the world's littlest pivot, spinning the heaven's hemisphere as a wine glass with a wet finger laid on its rim to make it ring. Feathers a rainbow, how you reel, hovering over blossom, cheeks tucked into the honeysuckle to lap a single drop of nectar onto your tongue. Messenger goddess, kicking a gold dust of pollen out of your winged heel. The slow promise of your approach makes my throat thick. The joy gathers deep in my spine as if it were a snake making a smooth wave of muscle toward the taste of water. 